cardiovascularia, blood, I would say what's most obvious to me would be the combo of the cardiovascular and the blood. Again, it's not severe. It looks more like blood ingredients, so take a look at that. And I would also say there's potential for some thyroid indication, some sponginess. You get that? Mm -hmm. Anything you know about the thyroid? Um, I think I'm having thyroid issues, so okay. I have an appointment coming up. My cardiovascular, I had some kind of heart episode. I had back-to-back -back surgeries. Um, I had I probably died on the table, but they won't give me the handwritten notes. Okay. So. All right. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. All right. A little bit of cardiac. I would say the most obvious indicator for me with Kelly is cardiovascular. Mm -hmm. It jumps right out. Mm -hmm. Is there any feedback you can give us about that? Had SVT heart surgery twice on my heart. Mm -hmm. Okay. Back when I was 10 years ago. Okay. Haven't had any trouble since, though. Okay. okay. <laughs> That's a little it. bit of windburn. Okay, so a couple with the cardiovascular, a little bit of blood. Yeah. Okay. But good moisture. Yeah. Good moisture. That's always good news. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Thank you. Okay, Sal, do you want to go? Thank you, Sally. Okay, so now I would say what's most obvious to me with Sal is the neurological indicator. That is what I perceive at first go. I mean, there might be some other stuff, but I'm going for what's obvious here. I wasn't going to do a full assessment. I was going to go for what. So anything you could tell us about your health history with neurological? Yes, I've been having seizures lately. So I've had uh, three so far in my sleep. In your sleep? In my sleep. How long are you out for when you... Minutes, maybe four minutes, three minutes. So I, I don't really know. My wife tells me. I, I don't remember anything. I just wake up tired, okay. like I've run a marathon. Mm -hmm. And then I sleep for the, for the rest of the day. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Step over here, please. Oh. This side. Okay. I mean, so I would say, you know, what's most obvious with Kim is that I'm, you know, I perceive the upper, the, the light thickness. So, I mean, I'm just, that's my initial go-to. So some intestinal stomach. Is there anything you can share yep, with? Share absolutely. With? I have issues. Yeah. I have to be careful with what I eat, some sensitivities and stuff. And yeah, I will get issues and hold issues right here. Have you been given any formal medical diagnosis? With? Um, yes. Um, GERD. GERD. Okay. Um, and a little bit, actually more so hiatal hernia. Okay. Which is way up here. So sometimes it'll hurt really bad right here, and I have to push on it to stretch it out. No. No, I don't have any gallbladder issues to my knowledge. Okay. Is that it? That's my initial go to. 